uh, 8.30, uh, 21st of December and uh, just crossed the Lewis River. Uh, today I'm heading up the Nina Valley, gonna tick off uh, all the bivs up here. I've been up the Upper Nina before but haven't been to Lucretia before. Um, should be good. I think I'm going to use the flood route on the true right of the, on the true left of the Nina. Um, yeah, we'll see. Travelling light, so it should be pretty quick. I'll uh, we'll see how we go. View down to the lowest there. Yo, shall we? Well, it's not even nine, and I'm already sweating. It's lining up to be a scorcher. Uh, probably just straight in with the 2008. I just made it to the Nina River Bridge. Heading, I'll be coming back across that later today. Um, 30 minutes on the dot from the road to here. Pretty good. Um, but yeah, we'll get going. expected the the track is uh, a little rougher and I guess well less used than uh, the Nina Valley one uh, a little slow going which is kind of ideal for me um, but I don't really know how long uh, how much distance I'll be doing today and I don't really know how long it is but uh, I guess we'll just have to see got a ton of food and heaps of daylight so it's kind of all you need to get these things done. Anyway, there's the Nina. I uh, just made it to Lucretia, uh, Nina Hut flood route. I'll be going that way, but I'll get up here first. Uh, I actually scrapped that last clip. Uh, this is the crossing to uh, Nina Biv. I guess that's the official flood route, maybe. Uh, anyway, we're going this way. Lucretia stream now. Uh, oh yeah. Going over there. Woo. Just rocking up to Lucretia Biv. You know, I, um, it's a very nice spot. Waterfalls up there, pearler of a day. Uh, there's another hut bagged. Uh, let's have a look. Been repainted a few years ago, plenty of wood. Uh, looks like a track to the Upper valley, maybe access to the tops to Brass Monkey and that. Come on. Super nice in here. Mm. 
nice mats, nice bunk design. You can sit down on the bottom one. Uh, this bove here, uh, same model as Upper Nina, which I'll be heading to. Uh, not sure the hut code on them, but um, they're, I don't know, they're built throughout the 60s uh, by the Forest Service. Uh, mainly, oh, they tend to all be on the east coast really, as far as I know, and at low elevations than the, the B55s and 49s. A uh, little bit bigger footprint than those as well, and obviously higher, you can stand up in them like a, a proper hut. Um, Plenty were built, I don't know the exact numbers, but it's like the same as um, like Mackenzie, West, uh, Mathis, Biv, uh, Caroline Creek, Turnbull, uh, I don't know, Stony Stream and that, they're all the same. Uh, good design, maybe, maybe one of the best ever built. Um, but this one's in really nice condition. Uh, a lot of them are, because they have been restored, the ones that are still around, uh, for good reason. But uh, yeah, I'll probably have something to eat and then heading back down, onwards. What a ripper. Uh, not sure if I said, but um, it was two hours from the, the road to the Biv. Uh, just coming up, back to the Lacrida stream crossing for Nina Biv. Uh, hey. uh, now, I'm not sure what this track's gonna be like. It's actually pretty nice so far, and I'm surprised it's signposted and kinda marked. It looks like it's marked so far, but uh, it's not on Topo, but it is on some maps. There's a flood route, but um, I just saw a turn off last time I was up for the Nina for it and I thought I might as well check it out this time. Um, but no, it looks it's pretty clear at the moment actually, so might be on. Uh, the track's actually decently marked and it's nice and open through the trees. A few sections where the markers a little bit maybe not far between but out of sight. Um, oh, so many cobwebs man. Uh, I mean you would have to be an idiot to lose the track although I have lost a track twice already so I don't know what that says but um, so far, so good. Nice and quiet, no one around. Um, just finished uh, one of those. Who enjoys them? Like, how do they sell? Uh, I've made it to the Nina Valley track. That's back to the road, the way I've come. Biv, where I'm going. Um, yeah, I crossed the Dutchess stream pretty much right down by the Nina River, which I didn't expect to. I thought I'd be up in the bush here because there's like, I'm pretty sure like the flood route signs up here, but I don't know. Didn't uh, kind of, the track kind of fizzled out of it maybe, but uh, I'm where I need to be, so we'll get going. Uh, yeah, sign here, an old hut side or something. Um, then onwards. The bit of route, the turn off to um, uh, well, this is a Dutch stream trap line, but I'm assuming you could maybe kind of use that to get up to Brass Monkey. I've tried to go up Dutch stream a few years ago, but uh, it's a bit of a shit stream to be honest, or maybe that's just the way I did it. But uh, yeah, I'd go up the along the tops uh, to get there. <laughs> The 
bloody heat though. They're actually getting to me. It's too hot for this. It's too hot. But uh, getting up to the Nina Biv soonish. Uh, just made it up and then above, but uh, first, oh, it's too hot for these shenanigans. I tell you that. Oh. Oh. Um. Oh, well, that's uh. Uh, 4 hours 15 from, oh, since I've been going today. Here it is. Nice clearing. Ah, uh, probably buddy. Is that better? Kind of. Ah. Uh. And it is. Have a look see the exact same as the last one. Oh we doing of on it though. Oh blue max mate. Oh yeah. Probably about the same night here. My end. Uh I'll grab something to eat. I packed in a foot long sub, so I'm probably gonna smash that. Spend a little time here maybe and then back to the car. Oh, uh, just coming up to uh, Nina River Crossing now. Woohoo! Let's go. Oh, that's so good. Woo! Uh, Nina Hut. Uh, what's that? Devil skin. Route over there, um, an hour with three minutes from the biv, not bad. Uh, here's the hut, pretty flash, modern hut. My reaction to modern huts. Anyway, I don't think anyone's here. No one's in the valley today. Crazy, well, not that I've seen. Well, I'm still at the hut, a um, little update, I just projectile vomited four times, um, my subway is like all over the ground there, won't show it to you, um, I don't know what it is, I feel it right now, maybe, but my pace is going to drop because I'm about to hit the wall now, yeah, I lost all that food, but I don't know if it was the water in this tank here because I just filled up. Usually I avoid the tanks. I like to fill up on the rivers. It's a bit, it's a bit safer, I reckon. But um, I don't know. I don't think it would hit me that quickly. But maybe it did because I scuttled a lot of water. Um, otherwise, maybe the river up by the Upper Nina. Maybe there was some dead possums upstream or something. Who knows? Well, maybe it was a subway. I don't know. No, probably not a subway. Compliments to the chef. That was delicious. Um, or... Tastes all right coming back up as well. Uh, well, I'll get going slowly. Yep. <laughs> back at the bridge. Woo! Wow, wow, wow. No. Every time I'm up here, I wonder if someone's jumped off there into the water. Definitely have. It's deep enough. Could be a sick spot. Not today, though. Uh, you're probably wondering where the 100k run is at. And I know. It's, uh, it's still coming. Uh, but my knees have been on and off the last couple months. Uh, this run today is kind of like a tester, I guess, uh, to see where they're at. They have been playing up the last maybe like 10k-ish, but can't take a Panadol or anything because not sure how my tummy, my my tummy, my tummy's going to be like 
uh, taking painkillers now. They got no food in me. Um, so I'm just gonna thug it out today. Sometimes you just gotta do that, don't you? Uh, yeah. Uh, I don't know when the 100K is gonna be. Uh, my knees are cooked, so that's why I'm doing so much hiking, because uh, old people love hiking, and my, uh, my body's getting old, so I don't know. Check this out. Oi, oi. Uh, nearly back at uh, the Lewis River Bridge. Um, come in nearly four, so seven and a half hours all up. Uh, just Strava reckons I'm coming up. Oh, just past um, uh, 37 k, so pretty good. I don't know what that pace is, but. I think it's all right. I was just trucking along all day, considering how much bog there is up that valley and how uh, dense the bush is in some places. It's not so bad. Um, definitely the tactical vomit. Maybe it helps. I don't know. Who knows? Um, make myself a bit lighter. I uh, don't know if it was that Nina Hut water, but I don't know how quickly how quickly bad water would take effect because that was literally a few minutes after I'd drunk it but maybe, I don't really know um, anyway, pretty good day out in the front country uh, ticked off a new, one new one new biv which is always good um, and yeah, sweet uh, guess this is probably it um, see you in the next one